Today we will discuss about mean stack interview questions. Uh, recently I have uh, switched my job and uh, I have given around 50 interview to the multiple companies like uh, uh, TCS, Infosys, uh, HCL, Cognizant, EPAM system, CGI, Optum and all these type of like big MNCs and also like mid level companies. So I have given around 50 interviews, 50 interviews and uh, on behalf of those interview i have uh, like collected and noted noted all interview questions and uh, that i was asked to this uh, interview so as a part of mean stack interview i will cover all these type of interview questions like uh, uh, you see here uh, let me show you so here i will cover in this uh, video series like a uh, mean stack interview questions video series i will cover all the questions like node.js interview questions angular javascript mongodb and logical programming questions logical programming question if you talk about this so here i will cover like uh, you can say array uh, string uh, object so uh, generally interviewer ask the logical programming interview questions on the basis of uh, topic if you say that will be array string and object so array string or object ke base pe wo kya karta hai questions rise karega like uh, if i say about the simple questions like uh, he will give you one array and he will say like sort this array by ascending or descending order so there you you will you cannot use the built-in function you have to use like a uh, if else statement like conditional statement you can use loop you can use some keywords so all these type of things that you can use to solve that like uh, to uh, give the output like uh, uh, what uh, interviewer uh, asked so and also like i will cover the aws interview questions that i that i have given and uh, if you talk about for the if you uh, going to like prepare about the cloud interview questions so if you have knowledge about aws then you can prepare for aws otherwise you can prepare for azure or, or gcp and next thing like i will cover general technical interview questions in general like you can say what is uh, agile methodology what is uh, solid principle all these type of questions is also asked uh, to these type of uh, big companies so uh, like you, you see uh, i will cover seven type of interview questions to this video series okay and uh, one thing like uh, in interview you will be also asked about the javascript output based question so uh, that is i am covering into my shorts video so in short video uh, you will fi find that i will also uh, give the link into the description box where you can find like the short video series where i will i'm come covering i will create like around 100 short video where i will uh, cover all the all type of uh, interview question like that is uh, based on output like what will be the output of this so i will cover all these so let's go uh, in this video i will discuss about the uh, node.js interview question that will be our part one of this video series that is a node.js interview question so let's see here uh, here you see like uh, uh, node.js thing, things i have given the title of the uh, document like node.js thing okay so into this when you uh, here you can say top right uh, not top right in right uh, right side you will see one of 27 so i have uh, written like i have noted and collected all those type of interview questions that has been asked to me uh, into these uh, documents so all type of questions you will be uh, you will get here uh, from this document some questions i will uh, i am uh, showing you here like uh, this is a basic questions like a node.js and key feature of node.js okay what is first class function and uh, this is set immediate uh, this is timer function you can say process dot next tick so these are the important question like they will uh, definitely ask like which one uh, which uh, one will uh, run uh, first like a set immediate or process dot next tick because both are uh, like timer function we can say promises are like you can say basic question and it will be asked in, uh, on each and every uh, interview okay so you have to be very clear and very deep knowledge about the uh, you should be very deep knowledge about the promises also and there is multiple states of the promise like pending fulfilled rejected and type of promises you can be also asked to this question like chain promise promise dot all so all this you have to cover and when i go down you will be see like uh, experience in experience software developers interview questions like when you go down so let me show you 
uh, here it is a phases of node js event loop okay multiple phases you can you can be asked this question also and uh, many more questions you can see here uh, let me show you some uh, importance uh, like a uh, difference between fork and spawn method so this question is also asked to me uh, about this like what is fork and why we use fork method spawn method okay and the basic thing like about the event loop so in a previous video i have covered about the event loop like how event loop execute these type of questions uh, let me show you here it will be i think uh, yeah like we have a multiple examples you can say here we have a console.log we have a set timeout we have a file system operation we have a promise we have again the console then what will be the order of execution like order of the output to this type of uh, if we have a task given to a event loop so how event loop executed and gives the output in which order so this is also important this type of questions is also asked to the interviews so uh, call stack uh, node api like this is the part of the event loop here you see so guys uh, i think uh, uh, like to explaining 27 pages if you see here 27 pages it will be more time consuming and time taking so uh, if you watching this video then you can ask me in comment box like i will share this docs with you okay uh, only I will share not I'm uh, attaching it into the description box or comment box I will only share to those like who is actually looking uh, like who actually want this and uh, want to prepare for the interviews so it, like it will these questions will cover for one to ten years of experience if you are uh, if you are having one to ten years of experience in a mean stack or node chairs or something in JavaScript developer so these type of uh, like all these questions will be helpful for uh, to those uh, software engineers that is uh, comes between one to ten years of experience also for freshers also because when you go from starting so uh, the starting from the basic interview question that is asked for the freshers also so guys uh, hope you found this video helpful and uh, if you like the video please subscribe the channel and share with your friends uh, see you soon in next video where I will show you the uh, angular interview questions so uh, please uh, if you need this document uh, please comment in comment box and uh, i will share to uh, there okay so guys thank you thank you very much